to our channel. I'm Nikki and I'm Rachel and, and we we're the Stitch Sisters. Sisters. Welcome to another of our lockdown videos where we're social distancing as I'm sure all you guys are too and in this video we thought it'd be really fun to give you a rundown of all of the patterns that we're all craving at the moment. So these are patterns for comfortable clothes to waft around in at home while you're doing your work. Those super comfy loungewear, sleepwear, elasticated waist patterns. That's all you really want to wear when you're spending all the time at home. I don't know about you, but I've realised I've got a bit of a gap in my wardrobe for loungewear. So we thought it would be a really good way of kind of updating everyone and giving you some new patterns to look at. So we've put together a video with our top 10 patterns. This week we have indie patterns and next week we'll be back with commercial patterns. So at number one, we've got the Pomona shorts and trousers from Anna Allen. Anna Allen does fantastic minimalist patterns and we just think that these trousers and shorts are perfect for lockdown. They're really beginner friendly, they have an elasticated waist which means that you can just pull them on and off and they come in three different varieties, a wide leg, a slightly more tapered leg and a short that has patch pockets. They come in sizes double zero to 22 so they will fit most body shapes and they're just a really simple, quick and easy sew. So at number two, we've got the Pippet loungewear set from Common Stitch. And I really fell in love with this when I saw it because I thought it looked so cool and comfortable. Perfect for slightly warmer climates, perfect for the weather we've got here in the UK at the moment. So this is an elasticated waist short, but it's not a short short. This is somewhere in between knee length and very short shorts. So it's perfect for wearing in the day. You could also wear it as pyjama set, but I think it'd be much nicer to wear wafting around the house. It's teamed with a sort of cropped, uh, loosely fitting shirt that has these big sort of flared sleeves at the side. And I think it does look really cool and you could mix and match these. They don't have to be worn as a set, but I do like them together. At number three, another new pattern from Chalk and Notch this time. This is the Paige hoodie. And we chose this one because unlike lots of hoodies, it's actually cropped, not dangerously cropped. You're not seeing anything, but a cropped length when something's oversized can work really well for lots of people. And the thing we like about this one is it comes with either a standard band that you'd get on the the bottom of a hoodie or also a drawstring and you may remember from our spring trends that drawstrings are a big thing this season so it's bang on trend too. There are three sleeve options and because it's got raglan seams then it's perfect for colour blocking so you can really have some fun with your own creations. At number four is a personal favourite and this is the Kilo Wrap Dress by Named Patterns. This is the comfiest dress I have ever made. I made one out of a really lightweight scuba fabric but you can make them out of jersey. It's a pull-on kind of t-shirt style dress. It can be maxi length, but you can make it slightly shorter. It has no sleeves, so perfect for warm weather. And that wrap around the middle just gives you uh, enough of a tightness if you want it, but also can be really loose if you prefer it loose fitting. So I think it's really flexible and I think I do need to make another one. <laughs> At number five, we have the Donovan skirt from Helen's Closet. Now this is another super beginner friendly pattern, but it's also a quick sew and a comfortable make for anybody else. It has a simple elasticated waist that can either have an optional drawstring or just left with elastic. It has a loose fit, really roomy pockets, and it comes in two different lengths, either a shorter length that kind of knee length or slightly longer and the longer version also has side slits which is another big trend this season. It comes in sizes 0 to 30 so very very inclusive patterns from Helen's Closet. Number six is Our Lady of Leisure with the lemon drop dress and I do love a t-shirt dress and this is a really nice feminine looking t-shirt dress. I don't think it's too overpowering it has kind of like nice soft edges to it so you've got a nice curve curved hem at the bottom with little side slits up the side. It's got a nice boat neck. It's, a, it's not too fitted. So you've still got that looseness, that oversizedness to the, to the actual pattern. You can belt it if you want to, but I think it's a really nice one for wafting around in. And I'm sure in your fabric stash, you've got a few jerseys you've been saving. So this would be a really good one to show off a really good pattern because you've got a big expanse of fabric. There's not an awful lot of detail detail going on in the actual dress so you can have fun with the fabrics on this one as well. 
it comes as a boat neck but it also has two different lengths of sleeves so you've got a little turn up on the end of the sleeve and it's either a short or a long sleeved and it can be made as a t-shirt or as a dress so I think this is a really good versatile option and I think I need one of these ones too and number seven we have from Schnitchen Patterns their OM yoga set. Now this is a great one because it's three patterns in one. You get a standard sweatshirt, you get a vest top and you get leggings. Now I say leggings but I would say this is more of a slouchy legging. It's kind of a cross between a track pant and a legging um, but it looks really comfy and I'd imagine it made in a really soft French terry. It would just be so gorgeously soft to wear. The vest top has a racer back and a v-neck and the sweatshirt is just a standard set in sleeve. I think these would be three great options that you can mix and match. It comes in sizes 34 to 46. Number eight is the Patsy Overalls by Ready to Sew. And the overall trend, dungarees are not going anywhere. And definitely in the conditions that we're in at the moment, what you're looking for is an oversized pair. You don't want anything too tight and restrictive. You're definitely looking for those big baggy overalls that you can do anything in and I think this is the perfect pair. So you've got no fastenings, there's no zips, there's no buttons, there's no sliders, there's no clips, it's just the fabric on this one. So you're looking for something which is a sort of more of a, a mid-weight fabric so you're looking for a linen or something like a heavier cotton but something that's going to be breathable so you're going to look for fabrics which are organic or which are natural fabrics and I think if you got the right combination this would be the perfect pair of overalls. At number nine, we have the Hudson pant from True Bias. Now there are so many different types of track pants out there and we could have recommended all sorts of different options. But the reason we chose these is because they're so hugely popular. If you go to Instagram and search the hashtag Hudson pants, you'll find so many of them and you'll be able to see what they look like on all different shapes and sizes. They're described as an urban fit, which basically means they have a slightly lower rise, but they are roomy at the hip and then they taper at the leg. And you can either have them full length or you can have three quarter length. The great thing about the Hudson pants is they also have a men's version and a kid's version so you could make them for the whole family. They come in sizes 0 to 18 so slightly more restricted than some of the other options but we still think it's a great pattern. And at number 10 we have an ebook for you. This is the loungewear edit ebook by Workshop Patterns and I'm really excited about this because I think with the, what they've got on offer here is really good value for money. They've got five patterns that give you eight different variations and all for £18 which I think is really good. They've all been designed, all of the patterns have been designed with elasticated waist, loose fitting, oversized. So they're all meant to be mixed and matched or added into your wardrobe as sort of lounge, comfortable loungewear options. And I think this is perfect for the conditions we're living in at the moment. So in this, you have five different patterns. You've got a dress, a shirt, trousers, a jumpsuit and kimono. And that took me a lot to remember all five of those. So I hope you appreciate it. <laughs> They've all got elasticated waist. They're all meant for natural fibred uh, fabrics, so cottons, linens, something like that. But they're all really cool patterns. And I think as a collection, they would go really well together, but also they would intersperse within your wardrobe and give you lots of different cool and relaxed options. So there you have it. That's your top 10 indie patterns, perfect for lockdown. We will see you next week with 10 more options for commercial patterns for your lockdown leisure wear. Let us know if you've got any others that you've been eyeing up ready for comfort sewing whilst you're at home. And if you decide to make any of the ones that we've listed here, please do let us know. Now remember that in these strange times, sewing is a really, really great way to take care of your mental health and that self-care is more important than ever. So it's perfectly fine to take a little me time for yourself to sew up some super super comfy makes to get you through have a great weekend bye. bye if you enjoyed this video please give it a thumbs up and if you haven't already subscribe to our channel make sure you check out all of the playlists we've set up including our new stay at home playlist perfect for diy projects at home and if you haven't please head over to our website to check out our online sewing classes